Scottish folk and fairy tales. I'll first uh, attempt to read this tale in Scots, and then I will follow it up by reading it in English. The Marriage of Robin Redbreast and the Wren. There was once an old grey pussy bodrons, and she gaed away down by the waterside, and there she saw a wee Robin Redbreast happen on a breer. And Robin and Pussy Bodron says, Where's to go on? Wee Robin. And Wee Robin says, I'm going away to the king to sing him a sang this gied yule morning. And Pussy Bodron says, Come here, Wee Robin, and I'll let you see a bonny white ring round my neck. But Wee Robin says, Na na, grey Pussy Bodrons, na na. You worry the wee mousy, but you see, you need worry me. And Wee Robin flew away till he came to a fell fall dyke and there he saw a great greedy gled sitting and the great greedy gled says where's to gone we robin and we robin says i'm gone away to the king to sing him a sang this good yule morning and the great greedy gled says come here we robin and i'll let you see a bonny feather in my wing and but we robin says na na great pussy but great greedy gled na na you pook it away the the wee linty, but you see, you know, pook me. So wee Robin flew away till he came to the clay o' crag, and there he saw Slee Todd Lowry sitting. And Slee Todd Lowry said, Where's to gone, wee Robin? And wee Robin says, I'm gone away to the king to sing him a sang of this good Yule morning. And Slee Todd Lowry says, Come here, wee Robin, and I'll let you see a bonny spot on the top of my tail. But wee Robin says, na na, slee Todd Ra- Lowry, na na. You wee, you worried the wee lammy, but you see, you nae worry me. And wee Robin flew away till he came to a bonny burnside, where he saw a wee callant settin'. And the wee callant says, where's to go on, wee Robin? And wee Robin says, I'm going away to the king to sing him a sang of this good yule morning. And the wee callant says, come here, wee Robin, and I'll gi ye a wee grand moolins out of my pooch. But wee Robin says, na na, wee callant, na na. You'll spill the gowd spink, but you nitter, you need, you see, you nil spill, spelled her me. And wee Robin flew away till he came to the king, and he sat on a winnock soul and sang the king a bonny sang. And the king says to the queen, what will, we, what will we gee wee Robin for singing us this bonny sang? And the king, queen says, I think we'll gee him a wee ran for his wife. So wee Robin and the wee ran were married, and the king and the queen and all the court danced at the wadden. Soon he flew away hame to his ain waterside and hap it on a breer. And again, in English, the marriage of the Robin and the Redbreast. There was once an old gray pussy cat, and she went away down to the waterside, and there she saw a little robin red breast hopping on a briar. And the pussy cat says, Where are you going, little robin? And little robin says, I'm going away to the king to sing him a song on this good yule morning. And the pussy cat says, Come here, wee robin, and I'll let you see a bonny white ring round my neck. But the little robin says, Oh no, gray pussy cat, no. You might worry a little mousy, but you see, you don't worry me. And so the wee robin flew away until he came to a dike on the side of a field. And there he saw a great greedy kite bird sitting. And the great greedy kite bird says, where are you going, little robin? And the little robin says, I'm going away to the king to sing him a song on this good yule morning. And the great greedy kite bird says, come here, wee robin, and I'll let you see a pretty feather in my wing. But the wee robin says, oh no, you great greedy kite. No, you might pluck a bit of lint, uh, lint down feathers from your wing, but you're never gonna poke at me. And so the wee robin flew away until he came to a rock face. And there he saw a sly Mr. Fox sitting. And the sly Mr. Fox says, where are you going, little robin? And little robin says, I'm going to the king to sing him a song on this good yule morning. And sly Mr. Fox says, come here, little robin, and I'll let you see a pretty spot right at the top of my tail. And the wee, and the little robin says, no, no, sly Mr. Fox, <laughs> oh no. You might worry a lamb, but you see, you'll never worry me. And so the 
little Robin flew away until he came to the a pretty side of a creek. And there he saw a little boy sitting. And the little boy says, where are you going, little Robin? And the little Robin says, I'm going away to the king to sing him a song on this good Yule morning. And the little boy says, come here, little Robin, and I'll give you a little bit of breadcrumbs out of my pocket. But the little Robin says, oh no, little boy, oh no. You might be spilling your bread breadcrumbs, but you're never going to spill them to catch me. And so the little Robin flew away until he came to the king. And there he sat on a window sill and sang him a, a very pretty song. And the king says to the queen, what should we give the little Robin for singing us this beautiful song? And the queen says to the king, I think we'll give him the little wren to be his wife. And so the little Robin and the little wren were married and the king and the queen and all the court danced at their wedding. And after that, they flew away home to their own waterside where they sat and happily hopped along the briar.